Now, from a prototyping perspective, this actually worked out pretty well. You can see running with one job, it gave me a little bit over a second of iteration loop, not the tightest iteration loop I've ever seen, but not so bad that I couldn't quickly set up all of the things I need to set up in order to interact with this API and write all the code to take those API endpoint results and give me something that I can do some computations on. The problem is if I remove this break here and this break here, and instead of looking at just the very first succeeded job and the very first succeeded result for those jobs, I look at all of the succeeded jobs and all of the job results, this thing is kind of slow. I can take a lot of deep breaths in between each one of these steps. And what I might use is my simple timer to identify where that slowness is coming from. Because you can see I got 14 results and I still haven't done my pandas analysis. There are many places in this program where there is slowness. And identifying that slowness and the nature of that slowness will help me better use tools like AsyncIO, threading, and multiprocessing.